These flicks give new meaning to out of this world. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 astronaut movies. Do you read me, Hal? Affirmative, Dave. I read you. Number 10, Space Cowboys. We're here because a satellite with your guidance system on board is about to re-enter the atmosphere. The system is non-responsive. You want to take a crack at it? Space travel is a young man's game, or it was until Space Cowboys. As the only ones with knowledge of the old school technology, four retired astronauts are tapped to head into space, where they make life or death choices to survive. Ethan, do not lock onto those Pam rockets, you hear me? Got it. Going from retirees to action heroes, the stars prove that they may have more than a few years between them, but outer space heroics are ageless. <laughs> Number 9, Armageddon. Cause I'm leaving on a jet plane. Michael Bay's Armageddon was the biggest worldwide hit of 1998. And how could it miss? It has a gigantic asteroid threatening to extinguish life on Earth, razor-sharp direction and editing, and a cast that plays the melodrama for all it's worth. Yeah, I remember this one. It's where the, uh, the coyote sat his ass down in a slingshot and he strapped himself to an Acme rocket. Is that, is that what we're doing here? With Bruce Willis in prime action hero mode leading his astronaut crew to save the day, it's a non-stop thrill ride. Harry. Clock on that nine foot nuclear weapon is ticking. Oh my god. Number eight, contact. I don't consider what could potentially be the most important discovery of the human race nonsense, okay? 1997's Contact engages your brain while plugging into your sense of wonder and awe. Jodie Foster shines as the scientist turned interplanetary traveler who initiates contact with another world. While it has plenty of tension and excitement, what one remembers most about Contact is its sense of endless possibility. Its subtle haunting beauty stays with you long after the final frame. I had an experience. I can't prove it, I can't even explain it. But everything that I know as a human being, everything that I am tells me that it was real. Number seven, Sunshine. Just remember, it takes eight minutes for light to travel from sun to earth, which means you'll know we've succeeded about eight minutes after we deliver the payload. The sun's light is going out, and eight astronauts must revive it by planting a nuclear weapon at its core. Negative, Icarus, negative. State reason immediately. Fire and oxygen garden. Hey, nobody said it'd be easy. Director Danny Boyle creates a tense psychological journey that combines a sense of desperation with an undercurrent of melancholy. Stardust is stardust. Sunshine loses steam in its last half hour, but its assets, including the sacrifices made by these heroic astronauts, make up for the lapse. Number six, Moon. How are things down there? You guys been any? Good parties or anything? David Bowie sang of an astronaut in his song Space Oddity. His son, director Duncan Jones, examined one in the mysterious, disturbing, and poignant moon. Three years is a long haul, you know. It's way, 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 way too long. <laughs> Sam Rockwell plays a man on a lonely three-year mission on the moon. His only company is a computer named Gertie, voiced by Kevin Spacey. Would you like some hot sauce on your beans? No, I'm, my tummy's a little tender, actually. What happens when he discovers he's not actually alone? You sent someone in the room with us. Adroitly directed, beautifully shot, and featuring a stunning central performance, Moon is a one-of-a-kind film. Yeah, Eliza, he ain't going nowhere. Number five, Planet of the Apes. Man has no understanding. He can be taught a few simple tricks, nothing more. What can you say about a film that inspired sequels, reboots, comics, and a TV show? Planet of the Apes astronauts from the future land on a world where apes rule and humans drool. 
Rod Serling's screenplay touches on many social issues, but its messages never get in the way of action and adventure. Take your stinking paws off me, you damn dirty ape! The only thing more unforgettable than Roddy McDowell and Kim Hunter's adorable chimpanzees? Charlton Heston's marvelously overwrought discovery that he hasn't traveled so far from home after all. Oh my god. I'm back. Number 4. Marooned. Roger, trajectory and guidance to go. The plot to this Academy Award winning astronaut flick eerily foreshadowed the drama that accompanied the Apollo 13 mission a year later. And it's hindsight that makes the tense, quietly absorbing drama of the three astronauts trapped in space undeniably gripping. Stoney, give us some line here. Stoney? We can't get to him. With a stellar cast that includes Gregory Peck, Richard Crenna, and Gene Hackman, Marooned outlines the danger, tough decisions, and courage associated with the space program. This is Iron Man. Pruitt? This is Keith. I'm sorry. We had to scrub the launch. Number 3. 2001 A Space Odyssey Arguably the most influential sci-fi film ever, 2001 deserves its reputation as the ultimate trip. The story follows an astronaut as he overcomes the evil but strangely human computer HAL to experience the journey of a lifetime, or perhaps several lifetimes. I can see you're really upset about this. Stanley Kubrick's landmark film is a stunning combination of extraordinary visual effects, masterful direction, exquisite cinematography, and an intriguing screenplay. Its meaning may be obscure, but its impact is undeniable. This conversation can serve no purpose anymore. Goodbye. Al? Al? Number two, The Right Stuff. Hey, Pancho. Mm. I was looking at the pictures on your wall, and I was wondering how come a fancy pilot like Slick over there doesn't have his picture up there? Philip Kaufman's Oscar-winning The Right Stuff explores the real-life challenges of the Mercury astronauts as well as the test pilots that paved the way for the later space missions. Drop. We watch as the astronauts go from being little more than manipulated window dressing to full-fledged heroes. The Right Stuff demonstrates the bravery, resourcefulness, and dedication needed to make history. What a heavenly light. Number 1. Apollo 13. Houston, we have a problem. Houston may have had a problem, but Ron Howard and his top drawer cast had no trouble bringing this real life story of a troubled NASA mission to the big screen. Did we miss a step here? Control? What the hell happened? I don't know. We just want to ask you. Viewers stay on the edges of their seats, even though a history lesson tells us these three astronauts made it home in their crippled ship thanks to quick thinking by the teams on the ground and in space. Hello, Houston. This is Odyssey. It's good to see you again. you agree with our list? Which astronaut movies have you over the moon? For more top 10s about your favorite flicks, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. <laughs>